Hello learners today we are going to learn about the first poem from our textbook honeycomb which is called the squirrel and it is written by Mildred Bowers Armstrong Before we start let's talk about squirrels you must have seen squirrels running here and there and all around the trees and gardens it is a rodent annoying mammal it is gray in color with brownish strips it is very playful and lively and has a bushy tail and is extremely cute and innocently naughty it also loves to eat nuts you must have observed the indian palm squirrel or i can say a three striped palm squirrel and let's learn a few things about the poet The poem Squirrel has been composed by the poet named Mildred Bowers Armstrong. She earned her bachelor's degree from Northwestern University in 1923. She also studied at Mount Holyoke College, the University of Chicago. Bowers titled her first volume of poetry Twist or Smoke. Twist or Smoke was the winner in the year 1928 and it won the Yale Younger Poets Prize and was published by the Yale University Press she is also the author of the favorite fairy tales many of you all must have tried to spend time and play with a squirrel at least at some point of your life this poem is mildred's description of such a squirrel as we all see that it is a very very short poem the poem has six lines in it yet it's very fun to read dear learners you can pause the video right here and go through the poem now let's recite the poem the squirrel He wore a question mark for tail and overcoat of gray. He sat up straight to eat a nut. He liked to tease and play. And if we ran around his tree, he went the other way. The poem is written by Mildred Bowers Armstrong. And now you see a picture of a squirrel. If you observe very carefully, can you see that the tail of the squirrel is shaped like a question mark? Can you see that it is bent in a certain way? And because of this, the poet says that the tail of the of the squirrel is bent like a question mark. Dear learners, now let's analyze the poem. The poet has drawn a living picture of the squirrel through her poem. Look at the picture of the squirrel on the screen. The poet describes how the squirrel is covered in gray fur, sits in an upright position on the tree branch eating a nut. It has gray fur all over its body, which looks very similar to a gray overcoat. Doesn't its tail look like a question mark? Yes, it does, right? Because of the shape of the tail is similar to that of a question mark. The happy and lively squirrel loves to play with the pot. It likes to tease and play and if anyone runs around him to catch him, he changes the direction immediately. Now let's quickly skim through the poem. The poem is about squirrels. The squirrel holds its tail in the shape of a question mark. It is covered with gray fur. It sits up straight while it feasts on nuts. It likes playing with people. If you run around the squirrel's tree, it runs the other way. So, to sum it up, the squirrel is a cute, lively, innocently naughty animal. The poem Squirrel is written by 
Mildred Bowers Armstrong and has a very simple short and interesting poem. Dear students, please do not forget to remember the name of the poet and its spelling. Mildred Bowers Armstrong